don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up the video. All right, on to the vlog. Atlanta Hawks head coach Mike Vanderbilt has been suspended one week for making contact with a game official at the NBA Awards on Saturday. Bud's going to sit out the Hawks game with the Indiana Pacers on Sunday. Yeah, I'm fortunate for Coach Bud. We know he's normally a full time guy. It's happened before. This point in the season, I think the Hawks have got enough momentum to really kind of hold down the foot for one day. Come on, Bud. Let's see what you Hippie pick here. pick here. Good morning. How you baby daddy, yo sister, yo cuz what I'm doing. And you have it too. How y'all living fam? <laughs> it's Sunday up in this V. And it's cold. And I'm down in the dumps. Why am I down, babe? I don't know, um, Jayla, could you Mind taking this one? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Move you your hands. Move 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 your hands. Hi. I told you to make him up with that light. See, look at him. He's, look at him. Look at him. He hates light. He'll be okay, honey. Oh, He'll, no. be... He'll be okay. Oh, no. He'll be okay. I can't get to him. Oh, oh, oh. oh. He's arisen. See? I told you. <laughs> I told you. He hates it. Pissed. He was doing tummy time, and as usual, he fell asleep for a little bit. And we've been just back here hanging out. It's okay, baby. It's okay. Ooh, he looks mad at the world. So I'm gonna tell y'all why we are or, or depressed you. or upset or whatever. Kid, why well, you gotta be me, man? Your boy goes back to work tomorrow, y'all. Sad. I'm so sad. <laughs> what about the guy that has to go feel? back after that? Going in all this time, but yeah, hey, it's time. It's time. It's time, baby. It's time. Yeah. You gotta, you, it was bound to happen nothing at some la point. Nothing lasts forever, y'all. And they were so gracious enough to even yeah. give you that time off to be with your kids. Yes, so that it's, 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 is amazing. I am grateful. Yeah, so. Just, uh. uh bless it's you. Like, it's like leaving a, it's like going on a two week vacation to a nice resort where be you're surrounded by beach waters and sand, oceans and seafood and all that stuff. And then it's your last day and you realize you gotta head back home. Yeah. That's pretty much what it seems like to Except me. it was a three month vacation on the beach or whatever. I didn't want to get you know, too specific. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just try to give you a little, you know. A little, little perspective. A little, little analogy. Little, small as an example, you know. Yeah. Just didn't want to go, go there where you went. Okay. Yeah. 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 I'm saying, yeah. Today I'm not as sad as I was the last time that I thought he was going to be going back to work on that Tuesday. Um. Wednesday. But I'm still no Tuesday was when I was upset though. Oh, really? It was the day before you were gonna be heading in. Go, 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 go. You know, but I don't know. Um, I'm so thankful that he was here. So I'm just t t taking it like that. I'm gonna be sad tomorrow when he goes though. I'll be sad tomorrow. I'll be sad tonight when it gets when it's real reality. And he really is going tomorrow. Yeah, I got. I got. He really go. is going. I gotta get an alarm clock or use my phone. Tonight. Yeah, no, Set you no. We're I gonna go get. I haven't set an alarm in a long time. Yeah, our clock is busted. It's a little different, the but clock I can do it. Is busted, so. It's gonna be a little different, but hey. Yeah. I'm trying to wake y'all up tomorrow. You know it's serious when you have to actually go fix up and get an alarm clock. <laughs> oh, y'all. It's finally happened. <laughs> Are you happy daddy's going? Where was that coming from? She's happy. You happy? 
You're so pretty. Nice one, nibble on those cheeks. Ah. Hi. My pretty baby girl. My pretty baby girl. My melon and infused ah. baby girl. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, my baby girl. Hi. Jax, are you still mad at me? Are you mad still? Mm. Look at him. Mm. It's okay. Babe. We're just hanging out as a fam on the bed. Oh, you getting up? Hi. You have something to say? I cannot wait till she starts to talk. Like, really cooing and stuff. Anyway, I saw you girls in her workout clothes. And uh, we're about to get our swole on right quick. I'm about to tell you how our scale situation happened earlier today. We'll tell you how that went when I get back from the Jimmy Gym. Because both Juice and I both got on the scale today. Oh my God, Juice, get away. We'll talk about this when we get back from the gym. <laughs> anyway, let me get to scooting. Babies have been fed a couple times over already. Yeah, maybe something to eat too. Jesus. You're over here laughing. Maybe what are you some laughing? Some coffee, some coffee, some yogurt, or you know, when I you get back and pick these protein pancakes. So uh, yeah, hurry and get back so we can do this. I mean, I can't. You can't make the protein pancakes, babe. No, I gotta make coffee. Oh, so you gotta make coffee, so you ain't got time to make protein pancakes? No, man, I can't do that. I can't do both, both of those at the same time. Oh my god. Alright, tell like walking Dad. walking through them Dad, tell Dad to make protein pancakes. Tell him. Tell him to make protein pancakes. Tell him to make protein pancakes. I can't help but kiss their chubby little faces. I just wanna bite their cheeks. You okay? You okay? You okay, babe? <laughs> All right, y'all. Time to get this protein shake and hit this. Gonna go. Love you. Mm. Mr. Man took a nap for a little bit and now he's up. Mm. You good? Mm. Good. Let's go see daddy. Let's go see daddy and baby sister. Can you believe he's a big brother by a minute? I think that's just hilarious. One full 60 seconds. Right? Right? 60 seconds. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, I love these kids. I was just editing. And uh, let's join your sister, shall we? Oh, she seems very content in her little rocker chair here. There she is, hanging out. She's watching the minions. Watch the minions over here. Well, you can't see them. They just peeked away. Anyway, let's get him situated. Let's get you in here. You look awfully comfortable, baby girl. Awfully comfortable, baby girl. Would you like the vibration on, sir? What would you like, sir? Anything in particular? Would you like something to drink? This one's great. That's what I like. Yeah. That's for a second, so he's probably a little hungry. Yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah, you're over here enjoying the vibration from the chair. Yes, you are, real big girl. With your big smile. Okay, let's get the vibration on. You ready? Yeah. Let's go. 
Yay! Can I have some cheese? Mama's hungry. Can I have some? Oh. Come and get some over here too. Y'all love when I eat your cheeks. Okay, here's your rattle. Here's Elephant Man. There you go. Boom. Would you like the rattle, honey? Here. Until we get you something to drink, sir. That's for you. Hey, Phil. Good boy. You shake it. You good? Okay, you see, guys seem pretty content. Let me get out of your way. Let me let you guys watch Minions. Mommy's gonna go to the gym, okay? Mm -hmm. I just finished editing. Mm -hmm. By the time I get back, I'll be done. Bless you. Here they are. Yeah, baby girl. Yeah. Y'all see her laughing, y'all? She never does it on camera. There she goes. She's happy. She's watching Minion. She's got Mr. Quack Quack. She's got her Einstein, her baby Einstein right here. Mr. Man, he's still trying to figure out things right now. He's trying to figure out what he likes and dislikes. <laughs> you know, he's got his rattle. He's vibrating as well in the chair. And uh, he's biting down on his little rat a little bit over here, trying to figure out whether he wants to eat. And he's got Elephant Man over here. <laughs> yes, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, let me get out the way. I'm sorry. I'm all in her way. She's trying to watch the minions. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, did you want Mr. Quack Quack, ma'am? Here's Mr. Quack Quack. Mr. Quack Quack. You guys already know, her and Mr. Quack Quack, they are best friends. Yeah, that's my girl. All right. I, let me see, what do I do with my, uh, what do I do with my watermelon? I just had a protein shake, and I am munching on some watermelon, and I have an hour and 36 minutes left before this video finishes up the upload. I managed to squeeze in editing a video. In the meantime, it's late, but it's going up, and that's the point. So I'm about to stuff my face with some of this watermelon, and then I made my drink for the gym. Boom. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to eat that when I get back. All right. I need some energy when you go to the gym, you know, you I'm going by the meal plan. I'm going for the meal plan. Doesn't you meal plan? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> That's about what she tells me to eat. I mean, the cool thing is, is that... Well, she told you that, yeah. Yeah. The good thing is, is that... I'm not going to argue with you, coach. <laughs> yeah, he actually got to talk to her the other day for the first time, like to meet yeah. her officially on, on FaceTime for the first time. Yeah. She's hilarious, y'all. Yeah. But, um... She looks like she was fixing some good food, man. Heck, I wish could yeah. <clears throat> box some of that stuff up. And send it over here so I don't have to do like, it. You know, like, a whole fresh on Rosie way. Okay. Just box that shit up. Send it our way, because yeah. we can use it. Yeah, especially the ones with the limes and the onions. That looks pretty oh, good. Oh, that looks really good. Yeah. yeah, so I'm hoping she'll show me that so I can show you guys that, too. Look it up, Christina. <laughs> but, um... But yeah, so I kind of, I just, I'm sticking to whatever she's got me down for on this meal plan. And um, it's been doing really well for me. So today it's going to be leg day. It is leg day. I do a little cardio. I was supposed to have done cardio this morning, so I'm going to do it along with my workout since I just wanted to spend time with them this morning and just hang out with them. <clears throat> and I still had to edit a vlog. So I um, went ahead and did that. I still have another video to edit. Actually, I have two more videos to edit. One for the other channel and then uh, another vlog. So, we're gonna get it all done, we're gonna get it all done. Yeah, she was doing meal prep yesterday, so <clears throat> I cleaned up the kitchen it's today. It's a mess. Teamwork, uh -huh. Yeah, that's she, how it works. As long as she meal preps, I'll clean this shit up. But, <laughs> the kids are gonna be cursed because they starting to hear us now, so. Yeah, but as long as she meal preps, I'll clean this stuff up. Especially after I hear about my, my uh. Don't say it, don't say it. Progress. Yes. Less. Just yes. keep watching the vlog, you will find out about it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So. 
a progress that I recently had. So. Yes, and my progress as well. Our our, our progress. Our, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, anyway, um, but yeah, what I was gonna say was the good thing that I re the thing I really like about this meal plan situation that I'm on, and I guess her way of doing things as coach for me is the fact that I'm not stuck or bound to a certain type of meat or a certain type of veggie or a specific um, fruit, you know. There are some things I have to stay away from, like I don't eat eggs on this meal plan at all because of my blood type. Um, that's what she's based my diet on. And then, um, you know, uh, she doesn't want me to eat tilapia. I'll have to have her explain why. But um, we have a couple other friends of ours who have also agreed with that as well and they, they consider tilapia bottom feeders um, look it up just put tilapia bottom feeders and it'll worst, kind of explain kind of why eat, what they say. yeah that's what they're saying so she doesn't want me to eat tilapia i'm not supposed to have eggs um not that she, i mean if i have eggs oh it's not the end of the world i'm just saying it's not on my meal plan you know and it's not you know but as far as like any other proteins i made steak yesterday i made chicken yesterday y'all saw that i had uh chicken thighs and not chicken breast and she's totally fine with that ground turkey it's not the leanest ground turkey i don't like yeah, the I super lean the ground turkey thing, right? yep uh, and ironically chicken enough thighs, the thick chicken thighs yep and I was like, yes, you know what I mean? So I love that. She like, allows me that flexibility so it's not, it doesn't become so stale and so boring. You know what I mean? So, because you guys know, well, no, for those of you guys that have followed me long, I always have to throw that in there. For those of you guys that have followed me for a long time, you guys know I've done meal prep a million times before. I've done meal plans before. I've done all kinds of things. Macros, IFYM, set meal plans, yada, yada. And you also know that I get very bored very easy. And for me, variety is extremely important when it comes to food because I'm a foodie. Look, he's holding his thing. Yeah, he's been holding it the whole time. He's still over here holding the rattle. But he's trying to eat it. He's trying to eat it. How you doing, baby? He's getting so big. And Mr. Quack Quack. <laughs> you can switch sheets with her. Switch nah, she's too comfortable. Yeah, I don't want to disrupt her either. Look, he doesn't want to put the pink sheet on it. I didn't want to either, though. We both looked at the sheet like, mm -mm. Go, buddy. <laughs> we don't want to you put go, the pink sheet. Go, there we go. You can't eat that side, man. It's okay, you can eat it. What you want, man? Go ahead. Do what you gotta do. So today we're gonna get, we're gonna read books. We're gonna do tummy time today, Miss Jayla, Miss Thang. We're gonna read books, and we're gonna do tummy time, and we're gonna work on words. This is what we do. We, we come up with a curriculum and we do the curriculum. That's what we do. So anyway, all right, let me get out of here. How long have I said I'm gonna leave? I don't even know. All right, I'm out. Yo, yo, yo. We made it to the gym, y'all. All right, so today's workout's gonna be legs. A little bit of chest, but primarily legs. Gonna get my 30 minutes of cardio in that I didn't get a chance to do this morning. Gonna knock that out and get this workout done. Then we got a couple errands to run. Juice has to actually get out a little bit today too. So I'm gonna head home, relieve him. Get, he's gonna get out, do a couple things, and then we hope to kind of meet in the middle so that we can go and get some things done for the kiddos. We might be heading out to Bye Bye Baby if all pans out. You guys know we didn't get a chance to get anywhere yesterday, which is gonna shorten the amount of uh, time we have to get everything that we want to get done done today. And it's a Sunday. Everything closes early on Sunday, and it's also colder outside today than it was yesterday. Yesterday. It was damn near 70 degree weather. Today, it's 50s, which isn't bad, but there's major wind outside, so it's even chillier, and I don't wanna have the kids out for too long, so we'll probably take the kids out for a hot second just because we wanna go and get that one errand done at Bye Bye Baby. We have some stuff to order, and I need to get some more little onesies for Jax. He's growing too, too fast, y'all, too fast. Um, and he runs out of onesies really, really quickly. So we're gonna do that. That's the goal. We're gonna see if we can get it done. Because like I said yesterday, nothing worked out the way we wanted it to. But we're gonna try to get it done today. So let's get this workout on so I can get back home and relieve juice. Y'all. So I just did 30 minutes on the treadmill. Did on an incline of between seven and eight for almost, what was it, 38 minutes, something like that? 38 minutes, almost 40. And did it at a speed of like 3.4, right? 
And then I looked at my workout and realized that I have squats in it. Real squats, like squats on the Smith machine. Very first time I have done Smith machine squats in almost a year. So it's gonna take some time. The angle at which I shot them squats is horrible. But the way that this little tiny as hell ass weight room is set up, I can't even talk weight room, is set up. There's only so much I can shoot in here without disrupting someone else working out, which is why I miss my other gym so much. So we're gonna get to the other gym soon. I just need the babies to get a little older because then it's just a waste of money. So um, for now, we're gonna work what we got. So I'm trying to shoot as many little exercises as I can. And like I said, when we get into my other, when we, when we get to my other gym, it'll be a lot easier for me too. And I'll still keep this gym membership. Um, it's too cheap not to keep the membership, but. Um, and it has its benefits too. So there's activities, other activities and stuff like that here we can do. But when we get to the other gym, it'll be a lot easier for us to shoot and Juice will be there too, working out with me. But for now, we just gotta alternate, you know what I mean? So that was my number second set, the second set of those. Um, and I gotta take it easy because of my neck. So, but the point with these squats is to try to go as low as you can. I'm not there yet. My mobility is not the way it used to be. So I gotta work my, my way there. But yeah, this is freaky. I haven't done squats in almost a year, so I only have 25s on each side. The bar itself, I think, is 45. So the, the bar itself, the bar that I'm using, is 45 pounds, I think. And then the uh, two weights, each side, 25 pounds. So I'm not gonna take it any heavier, I don't think, because um, right now it's just about getting the movement down and making sure that I'm not straining my neck. So let's get it. <laughs> Done with the workout, y'all. And as usual, we in the elevator. Like I did legs today, so my legs are done. I wanted to cheat myself out of that workout so bad. Y'all know I gotta do four sets of every exercise that I do. And your girl's pooped. Plus I did 30 minutes of cardio on top of that before the workout. Actually 38 minutes of cardio. So now, it's time to go home, get something to eat. All right, so I did some meal prep yesterday, as you guys saw on the vlog. So. I am going to eat this for my next meal. Green beans, roasted red potatoes, delicious ground turkey. I'm gonna go ahead and nuke this in the microwave and that'll be my meal after the gym. This little one doesn't want me to eat. When I say I ate my food fast, like she has gas and I'm gonna have gas too because I ate that thing like it was gonna run away from me. But uh. Is she okay? Man, she wouldn't let me eat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I stuffed my face. When I say, if I, I'm gonna have gas bubbles tonight, cause I ate so fast. Mm. Life of a mom, right? Are you okay, baby? Time for us to give you some food, okay? Let me go make you a baba. But yeah, Jack's asleep. All right, we're in Bye Bye Baby. We're shutting down the store, pretty much. We got here probably about, we're like, we legit got here maybe 15 minutes, 10 minutes before they closed. All because we are doing nursery stuff, okay? <laughs> nursery stuff, nursery stuff. You guys will see the nursery. I promise y'all, there's been some snafus. I will explain that to y'all later on in another video, which is why you guys haven't seen the nursery as of yet. But we are placing the order for some of the rest of the stuff um, that we need. So, we're doing that right now as we speak. I see that, he's like. Hey, big girl. Hey, big boy. I heard somebody went poo poo. Could it be you? Yeah, somebody went poo poo. <laughs> so we run across this little crib right here, which we're probably going to have to get and put in the basement. <clears throat> this is definitely something good for twins, y'all. We got um, we got the uh, basketball goal in here. We got little stations for Jayla. Uh, we got a um, little grill in here. We got the soccer ball for both of them. A little vacuum for both of them. So this is definitely probably look good in our basement, man. We're we have to come back up here and get this thing some other time, but uh, yeah, that is nice. 
and uh, we better get out of here because it's as you can see it's dark and it's past closing time so uh, we're gonna go ahead and pay these good people and get on out of there so but we've been visiting with them also but they wanted to see the babies so yeah y'all let's uh get back to the crib hey my pretty shy girl hi hey my pretty girl you ready to get dressed my baby girl yeah now will you say hi She's got to think about it. See, she's got her pants on. Oh, not so much. Okay, Mama's gonna get you food. Okay, Baba, Baba. -ba. Okay, Mama's getting you, Baba. Baba's coming. Baba's coming. How you feeling, Lugbug? <laughs> Why you look so scared? I didn't even startle you. We've been having conversation. Hi. You get a good stretch? He was asleep in the car. I mean, not all this time before somebody misinterprets that. I mean, he was asleep in the car. We brought him in. He continued to sleep in the car seat. So we let him sleep a little bit in the car seat. Okay, people do it all the time. I just wanna make sure I clarify before somebody's like, you left him in the car. But anyway, my big boy. You okay? Time to eat, baby boy. Let me change your diaper first. He's excited. <laughs> Grab my hand with every bit of force, okay. Oh my God, could it be, baby girl? Look at her juice! Oh my God, I have it on video. I'm shooting it on video. Look, both my babies. Come on, baby girl. You had it, baby girl. You had it, baby girl. You just don't want to do it. Come on, baby. Come on, baby girl. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Here, here, here. You just put your hand. Come on. Come on. Come on, baby girl. Come on, baby girl. Come on, baby girl. Yeah, juice on, oh, on the toilet, y'all. <laughs> Come on, baby girl. Just don't have a desire to do it. Come on, my girl. You got it. Jackson's like, you got it. He's over here watching cartoons. We got it on a pig pig show. I don't remember the name of it. <gasps> look at you, look at you, look at you, look at you, look at you. Come on, baby. You know how long I've been trying to get you to do this? Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, girl, get it, girl, get it, girl, get it, girl. That's my baby girl. That's my baby girl. That's my baby girl. That's my baby girl. Yeah. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. You just wanted to do it on your own time, huh? She's lifting her head, or she's trying to, she was. Yay, come on, come on, come on. That's my baby girl, that's my baby girl. My baby, oh, I'm gonna cry, my baby girl. You got it, girl. You got it, baby girl. You got it, my baby girl. Okay, okay. And then Mama's hype. Y'all gonna be like, damn, you're too loud. But look, I'm excited. We've been trying to get her to do this forever. Oh, I know. I know, baby. <laughs> Jayla. Look at you! Oh, yeah. Yay, baby girl! Baby girl, meanwhile, Dad's missing it all because he's on the toilet. He's taking a poo poo. Thank God for the video camera, huh? My baby boy. Yeah, my baby boy. Yes, my baby boy. Come on, baby girl. You got it, baby girl. You just gotta look up, baby girl. You gotta look up, baby girl. Oh, poor thing. <laughs> Still there.
I know, I, I had, I got a whole booty sometimes. Okay. Right hmm? She is so funny. You hear the quiet, babe? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Mommy and good. Mr. Quack Quack. Ah, she's good. That's it. Uh, <laughs> straight. Yeah, she knows how to do it already. You gonna are you gonna miss all this craziness here in this household? Yeah. yeah I'm gonna miss it. I can't believe the mall's actually here. Well, mm -hmm. it's on its way. It's actually a reality now. I gotta go back to work. And why are you not eating the ground turkey? Why do you keep eating meat off topic? Why are you eating chicken? Hey man. Hey, ground turkey gives me diarrhea. It does not. How are you gonna tell me what does and doesn't give me diarrhea? I know, trust. Don't you think I would know if certain things gave me a certain reaction? And diarrhea being one of them. Whatever. That's he me. really is going back to work tomorrow, y'all. Like, real, real, real. Really, for real, for real. Yeah, no joke. Going back <laughs> to work. No more. <sighs> no more pushing off. No more postponing. Yeah. No mosh. No mosh. Hold on. Let's see. <laughs> My bad. Had to change the battery. There's not much juice left in this battery either, but it's better than the battery that was in it before. Anyway, but yeah, y'all, juice is really going back to work tomorrow, bright and early first thing. Mm -hmm. And, um, uh oh. Mm -hmm. No, she, Mr. Quack Quack was going somewhere. And, um, I'm gonna miss him. I'm gonna miss you, babe. Are you gonna miss me and the kiddos? Oh yeah, I'm gonna miss the whole family. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna miss everybody. It's gonna be Please, weird. It's gonna be weird. Back. Yeah, I'm a, <laughs> that's gonna be it's weird. It's gonna be different. It's gonna be different. Yeah. I know some of y'all are gonna, you know, have been saying too in some, you know, vlogs that you guys are gonna miss him. Also, um, in the vlogs, he will be in the vlogs, by the way, guys. Um, I don't want you guys to think that he won't be in the vlogs anymore. He absolutely will be because. I mean, he is coming back home. It's just, you know. <laughs> yeah, it's just a temporary leave. Yeah, it just sucks that yeah. he's not going to be here during the, during the day part. Yeah. But that's just, that's how most, well, not most families. I don't want to say most families, but how a lot of families work. We were just fortunate enough to have a longer paternity leave than most people. Yeah. So, we all got accustomed to him being here. But um, reality is, reality is here. And he has to go back. But Yeah, things about to be a little, a little bit different, but, you know. We'll have to adjust like we have adjusted to everything having these guys you know in our lives now yeah mm. Mm. you're gonna have to adjust to stop eating my food matter of fact i was just about to ask you no i take two of these no. Work, hell no you take the ground turkey not the I chicken do that. juice you can't eat wait 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 wait, wait, wait. what's in mm -hmm. the what's wait 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 i haven't even touched the steak yet good good there's more in there. No, but I didn't touch the steak. Is you gonna just touch the steak, eat the steak? Well, the chicken wasn't enough for me. You know, you, you told me I need to eat more than just the chicken. No, I didn't tell you to eat the steak. Well, you told me to eat more than just the chicken. <laughs> what else is there? The food you have in the fridge for you, because you're not dieting. You see, you're gonna miss me, right? Yeah, I guess. You make it easier to not. <laughs> Just kidding, y'all. No, yeah, I am dieting. The lies. By the way, we haven't even told you guys about the scale situation. Hmm. So yeah, you, great want, you want to tell I am them? But lies. <clears throat> but as you were, would you like to tell them about your scale situation? Yeah, the reason I'm still eating these meals that she, what you, pre-prepped or meal mm. prepped, whatever. Mm. <laughs> I'm hiding them so that when you come back, they're gone. The reason I'm still eating your meal prep meals is because I've had great results in the gym lately. Mm-hmm. The couple times you've been. Yeah. In mm -hmm. the last few in the weeks. Week. The week that I've been really shade. The week that I've been running. <laughs> and I started doing I started doing some of Jessica's workouts, a modified version of her workouts. I haven't done the entire workout, but I've done some moves she gave us from her workout. In those same two workouts. <laughs> Everybody has to start somewhere, right? <laughs> true, 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 yeah, true. Yeah. Yes, yes. As you were, as you were. Uh, 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 as you were. Well, 
So <clears throat> last week when I when I weighed myself here at the gym, I weighed 254. Mm -hmm. So a few days in the gym, some meal prep. Some meal prep eating. Mm -hmm. And as of today, your boy is currently down to 245. Do it, two things in one. 245, y'all. Lost nine pounds in one week. Off of two workouts. God is good. And eating all of my food. It ain't just me, y'all. It's God, too. Right. God is good, man. Anyway. Guys have it so lucky. They just, they just stop drinking soda. Skip one Snickers bar and they lose 20 pounds in like, you know, a couple of days, babe. I put down that ice cream and... He got baby. Y'all, he was grubbing dub dubbing on some ice cream, yeah, some food. Pasta, ice cream. I put all that stuff down for a week. Oh, you, we just ran out of it. Well, yeah. I put it down. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. No matter how you want to... <laughs> hey, no matter how you want to spin it, it's still the same thing. Look, I'm hating, I'm, I'm, but I'm, I'm, I'm happy for him though. For I'm just giving nah, him grief. Y'all know I give him a lot of shit. I do, I do, I do. And that's just me be giving, giving him grief. Losing but no. nine pounds in one week is losing nine pounds in one week. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, well, your girl got on the scale today, and because he wasn't sure if the scale was wrong, like he was like, "Oh, something's wrong with the scale." So I got on the scale because I wanted to see. I was like, "Well, let's check and see." You know what I mean? I was like, "The scale's not wrong." I was like, "But let me get on the scale," and I lost six pounds in the last I'm, I'm moving into week two i'm in week two now so week, in the last week, week in some odd yeah week, week three no this coming week is week three okay. yeah, yeah 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 this coming week is week three but i've lost six pounds so that's really yeah, really really right. good yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah and uh i mean i'm not trying to like lose a shit ton of weight or anything like that um i'm trying to lose you know some excess junk or whatever but my primary focus is to just try to get my body in the healthiest physical shape that it can be in when i say that i mean i'm talking about you know with my endurance and all that other stuff but in addition to that i really want to push my body not push it to hurt hurting myself but push it to um i don't know i want to put get it get my body to a point where it's just never looked as good as it i mean it's never looked this good does that make sense I'm trying to articulate what I'm trying to, the goal I'm trying to attain. But essentially, I want my body to look the best it's ever looked, period. Like, before kids, after kids, whatever. Like, I told myself, once I have the kids, we're going to get the body to look as good as I can get it to look from my body type. You know what I mean? And, of course, within reason, because I love food and there's just only so much dieting I'm going to do. But, so I'm pretty much um, giving myself a good year and some odd, you know, to really do that. It's going to take a while for that to happen. It's not going to be something that in four months, all of a sudden, I'm going to have muscles protruding. But the goal is to have, you know, to become, you know, to get leaner, definitely to get leaner, to um, tone up big time. I want to have, you know, the little delt, delts, you know, on the shoulder area, the little, you know, the little indentions. But not where I'm like all super duper buff looking like a dude. I'm just saying... Where I'm still feminine, still sexy, still healthy, you know, but a little bit more cut up, a lot more cut up than I am now. I'm not cut up now, I'm just soft, but you know what I'm saying. So that's the goal. I want to get myself not in competition form because I would be torturing myself food wise, but I want to get myself in, um, I just want to get myself in fit form, you know. And, you know, I can pick oh, up the babies and hold them on one side, on each side, and take my little photo picture, my after picture, and be like, bitch, this is what I look like after twins. Yeah, that type of shit. All I want to do is... Six pack, you know. All I want to do is get ready for this 7K with Elliot in April. That's the other thing is that... Um, Remember that thing we told y'all about, about the 7K or whatever? Well, we just realized that it's coming up, like, in April. It's actually April something, 9th, 1st. Oh, 9th, yeah. Oh it's coming up like yeah. super soon. It's going to be less than a month away here in the next few days. So they have the option to do a, what is it, a 5K, a 7K? Well, Elliot's doing the half marathon. Right. I told him, hey man, <clears throat> I'm going to holler at you later on on that. Yeah. I'm going to do 7K and call it a day. Now, he wants us both to do it, okay, and maybe maybe even incorporate the kids and, like, push the kids or whatever. They may not be developmentally ready to handle me pushing them, yeah, like, running with them on a... <laughs> Push him no damn. Shoot, push seven or four. Yeah. 
Look, Maybe. I am not a long Maybe distance runner. I right. hate long distance running. Um, I hate it. I sprint. We don't. We don't run. Um, long distance. Only long distance I fuck with is on the phone. You feel me? So I'm not really sure if I'm going to actually be participating in said marathon. Even though I told Elliot that both, you know, we both told him, yeah, yeah, we'll definitely do it. Um. If I could push the kids on a cart, you know, in a cart or whatever, and they had head control enough where I could do that, I would do that because that would be just a fun way to incorporate the kids. But they, I mean, as a month from now, I doubt that Jayla's head control is going to be on, on that level where I'll be able to push them. Even his isn't on that level yet. Like he has to be able to keep his head completely straight, I guess, um, according to the the stuff I've read about the, uh, the runners, um, strollers. So people are saying it's like, um... They'll probably need to be about six to eight months before you can actually mm -hmm. use the runner's st stroller to run with your kids. So that's going to be not an option. So I don't know. We'll see. It might just be that we just come to, we just go down and root juice on like we did for a tough mudder. I will never do a, a tough mudder ever in life. I've done a mud run, but I will never do tough mudder. It's the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. And I, and I didn't even do it. Uh, and he did it. And I won't do it. I will never do something like that ever in life. There's nasty, y'all. It's There's disgusting. Nasty. I'll never do it. Not worth it. I mean, not worth, not, not worth it, but it's not worth it to me. I'm not, I'm sorry, but this marathon here, we're going to think about because I'm already training, you know what I mean? So I really don't know if I'm going to do it, but we'll see. We're going to play it by ear. I'm, I told you said I would attempt to do like the couch to 5k because there's an option to do a 5k. So if I can start doing the couch to 5k, I just don't like long distance running. I hate it actually. So I don't know. We'll see. But if not, we will be there to root him on, and I will just be looking good on the sidelines because I will still have been working <laughs> out in the meantime. My shoes. <laughs> yeah, don't spill on the bed. I'm celebrating now. Yeah, it's a big ass glass of wine. Anyway, we're going to let y'all go. We've talked <sighs> y'all's ears off, but that's the good news about the scale uh, before we, were, we forgot to tell y'all. I thought we were sharing this tonight. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. But yeah, Juice is going tomorrow. It's going to be sad. And, uh, you know, it hasn't really, like, I think I was, just because we got a few extra days, I think I'm taking it a little bit better this time. Because mm -hmm. I was really sad, like, the last couple days before Juice was supposed to have gone last week. And then when he got those few extra days, it kind of gave me a little life. So I'm still kind of living on that life right this very minute. Mm -hmm. But I know tomorrow morning, it'll be real when his alarm goes off. So... And, you know, when we kind of lay down and kind of get settled, you know, because now the kiddos are asleep and stuff and we'll be able to sit here and watch a little bit of TV and stuff and just chill together. And then mm -hmm. it's going to really hit me. But, you know, this too shall pass. So after this, y'all, you're going to see how I can handle the kids. We'll go from there. But anyway, any last uh, remarks before you head to work, babe? No, man, just uh, just uh, trying to get my mind ready. To get back into the real world. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh yeah, this is uh this is it. It doesn't seem real, but when I wake up tomorrow at six, it will seem very real. Mm -hmm. Especially at six in the morning. Did you uh take out your clothes? Yeah. <laughs> you did? Hey, I got my clothes set out. You already man. did? Yeah. Okay, good. I got a little snacks. Good. Yeah, you already packed his lunch and stuff. Oh. Not lunch but snacks and stuff. <sighs> Hope the kids don't wake up like three or four in the morning when they eat. Jayla will. Yeah. Trust me. I know one of them will. Yep. They do every night, so. Yep. We'll see how that goes, y'all. But uh, wish me luck and uh, have a celebratory glass on behalf of me or. Yep. Have one, you know, just kind of celebrating our lives together. These past three months have been great, but nothing lasts forever. Yep. And you'll be back tomorrow afternoon when you get yeah. off work. We'll be yeah. fine. Yeah, so. Just going to be a little adjustment. We'll make it happen. Yeah, it was a small adjustment, so yeah. we'll make it happen. We got it. We'll just move on. And... Yeah. Anyway, y'all. All that good stuff. No more dwelling. We're done. We love y'all. I have my cry later. We love y'all. And, uh, yeah. We will both still see you in tomorrow's vlog. He just won't be at the beginning of it. Well, he might be. He'll probably he will probably be at the beginning of, in the mornings of the vlogs actually because um, 
we still got babies to attend to and they wake up when they wake up yeah, whether we early. have an alarm going off or whatever our day whatever our day brings or not so you guys will still sleep in the mornings so say good night dudes all right y'all wish me luck wish please pray for my sanity y'all yeah things are gonna be different mm -hmm. y'all know what i'm saying <laughs> we love y'all and uh yeah we will uh, see y'all in the next vlog thumbs up the video Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the notification button, that bell down next to the subscribe button if you want to be notified when we have new uploads because sometimes YouTube be tripping. Actually, YouTube has been tripping. So hit that bell down below and sign up to get um, notified when we upload new vlogs. We love y'all and we'll see y'all in tomorrow's vlog. <laughs> love y'all.